PDMA is proud to announce the release of MCE Gold 2.2, featuring Asset Scheduler and Energy Cost Analysis. The Asset Scheduler now provides a method to plan and schedule asset testing. Proper planning is crucial to any predictive maintenance program. With MCE Gold's Asset Scheduler, you now have the power to plan your daily, weekly, monthly, quarterly, or annual asset testing. As you can see by the benefits in front of you, our goal is to enhance the value of your predictive maintenance program. Now let's take a look at the software. You can see here by clicking on our scheduler icon, up pops our asset scheduler screen. And on the top we're going to do an MCE test. We have the ability to have the available actions for that MCE test on our left hand side and we assign what tests we want to do on the right hand side. We assign these tests to a specific individual, in this case it's an administrator, and we determine the frequency that we want those tests to accomplish. We also have the ability to generate a seven day in advance warning. Now where do these schedules reside? Well when we look in our message center we'll see that we have a list of the schedules that have been determined for this asset. In there we determine who's assigned to test this motor, what day the test is scheduled for, and what tests are scheduled. Now what happens if we change our condition code from a caution to severe. As you can see here we've changed the condition code from caution to severe and automatically we can see that in our asset scheduler we have a place for any severity increase we're going to generate a test request within two weeks of that severity increase and we're going to give a seven day in advance notice. So where is this stored? Once again we go back to our message center and we can see that we've changed our condition code and we've generated a test so that we verify the condition of that asset based on the change in condition code. Now let's talk about our energy cost analysis module. We are all being asked to reduce our energy consumption while still maintaining rigid production schedules. The easy answer to this dilemma is to increase the efficiency of all our motors. But do you have the data to support this decision? Or you perform the test, analyze the data, and have determined your asset has a problem. Now what? Do you replace the asset or pay for repairs? Can the replacement increase your overall efficiency, reduce your energy costs, and lower your carbon footprint? The Energy Cost Analysis module can help you find the answers. By entering data from the existing and replacement motors into the Energy Cost Analysis module, you can produce a comprehensive report giving you an accurate estimate showing lower production costs, increased efficiency, annual cost savings, and simple payback and capital recovery times. So let's take a look at this software. As you can see here, we look at our energy analysis icon, and up pops our energy analysis screen. In here, we want to look and change the efficiency of this asset from 90% based on nameplate, and the estimated is about 88% running. We're going to change that to 95% efficient asset. Once we do this, we want to see what is our annual savings going to be. So we've gone from 90 to 95, and we're estimating a 93% efficiency based on the condition that that motor is running in. As you can see here, our annual savings would amount to $22,846.78 in saved energy costs. Now, this would give us a simple payback in 2.6 years and a capital recovery of 2.89 years. We have based our replacement cost at $150,000 to replace this asset versus a $75,000 repair cost to repair the asset. By subtracting the two and looking at our $22,846 savings, we can see that in two and a half years we've paid for the replacement of this asset. And every year subsequent to that, you'll be saving this money towards the bottom line. And in today's highly competitive world, it's important that we're looking at every avenue possible to reduce our costs. Now, let's talk about how do we get this into the hands of our users. Well, if you're an MCE Gold customer, the 2.2 release is coming to you free of charge if you're under warranty. If you're currently not under warranty but would like to get back into warranty, we're offering a free promotion right now so that if you do get under warranty, you'll receive the MCE Gold 2.2 free of charge. If you're an existing WinViz user, please contact PDMA and we'll get you all the information necessary to get you into the MCE Gold software. 
Well, I'd like to thank you for your time. And if you have any further questions about PDMA and the 2.2 release of Asset Scheduler and Energy Cost Analysis Module, please feel free to contact us at pdma at pdma.com or call us at 813-621-6463, extension 118. Once again, thank you and have a great day.